Hey guys, it's Mouse 4 here, and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be talking about the first mob reveal to the mob boat. So first, let me show you the trailer that was given today. Oi. Hello? You're so cute. Are you lost too? I don't like the darkness either. Yikes, it's too dark in here. You must be the glare, the mob that lets players know when they are in an area that is dark enough for monsters. The glare flies to dark areas for you. When it gets grumpy, you will know that it's dark enough for monsters to spawn. You can also bring it with you and prove once and for all that you can be grumpy and cute at the same time. Will Tiny Agnes ever find Tiny Jens? Whose lair is this? Do you want the glare to join Minecraft? Tune in to Minecraft Live on October 16th to cast your vote and change Minecraft forever. So yes, that was that. The glare. Whatever this crutter is. Just gotta put that on loop. I don't... <sighs> okay, so th there's a few problems with this little guy. Number one, mainly being... Look at him. He's ugly. Like, really ugly. And another thing is, okay, so in Minecraft Java Edition, if you press the just the F3 key on your keyboard, or up in the top left corner of your screen, you'll be able to see the light level. And if it's zero, place down a torch. There you go. You're done. Problem solved. On Bedrock, yes, you don't have that problem. Well, I mean, you have that problem, but you don't have a way of telling what the light level is. But... Recently, in a Minecraft 1.18 snapshot, mob spawning was changed so mobs can only spawn in absolute darkness, meaning just light level 0. Not It used to be light level 7, but now it's 0. So pretty much, if you're in an enclosed area and you spam torches, you're fine. You're golden. You're grand. You don't need a mob to help you check areas. And there are... I hate to say this, but there are texture packs that do the same thing this glare does for you. Even for bedrock. there's You can just apply a texture pack, boom, bang, you're done. This glare, it's, I hate to say it, but it's useless. The only good thing about this mob is the fact that it's tameable. But it's not good. It's not good. And remember last time we voted for a flying mob, we got the phantom, so... You know, I'd be careful if I were you. And before anybody points out, no, this B armor is not coming to the game. It's not happening. It's just a little design detail they threw in. Same thing with the bolted copper blocks. They're not happening. Again, it's just a design detail. Same thing happened with the glow squid trailer where we saw whatever the credit's name is in a yellow submarine. It was just a Beatles reference. That's all it was. They're not coming to the game. So don't think if you vote for this, you'll get B armor because you won't. That's, that's, that's it. You won't. Either way, I think this guy is ugly and cute at the same time. I like the way his head looks, but all in all, personally, I won't be voting for him. If you vote for him, good for you. I don't really mind. But yeah, I just thought he was a little, a little bit obsolete considering all the changes made recently. But yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next mob. Bye.